Hey guys, it's Cannot Compute here, and today I'm going to show you how to lock folders. Now, I'm going to create a new folder just to show you as an example. So you'll go into the folder that you want the locked folder inside of. Right click and go down to new. Go to text document and call it whatever. You can call it whatever you'd like. <laughs> Double click on it and paste this. This right here will be inside the video description. Now you're gonna scroll down until you see if not and then the percent sign and password equals enter password here. That's where you're gonna enter your password. I'm gonna type mine as bruh because I think it's funny. Next you're gonna go to file, save as, go to all for save type and then type dot bat after the name. Go ahead and click save. You can exit out of this. Now you can delete this text document and we're going to double click on this. You're going to see the new folder has popped up. Double click on this again. You're going to see, are you sure you want to lock the folder yes or no? If you type yes, you'll see that it disappeared. Now there's a flaw in this and that is that if somebody right clicks this and hits edit, you can see the password right there. So what I'm going to show you right now is how to make it so they can't. So what you're going to do is right click and go down to properties. Go to security and click on the people that you don't want permissions to and click on edit. You're going to see this. Click on the person that you person or persons that you don't want to have permission and go ahead and click deny on all of these. I'm not going to deny myself of this because I'm the only person on this computer. But once you do that, hit apply and OK. And once they edit, they won't be able to see it. Now to get the folder back that's private, you'll double click this and enter in the password. Then you'll see your private folder. The other catch to this is that the folder will stay there until you double click on this and click yes again and it'll be gone. Thanks for watching. If this helped you, be sure to click that like button and hit subscribe. Even if you don't plan on watching any more help videos, who knows? Maybe I'll make a video one day that you think is cool and helpful, and it really helps me anyway. If you have a future video idea or any computer struggles, let me know in the comments, and I'll be sure to make it top priority to help you fix. I also want to give a big thanks to Tech2 for creating the video that showed me how to do this. The only reason I made my own was just to show you a little bit faster and to show you how to lock the folder so that people can't see your password. Anyway, I appreciate it.